Hey bud, how's it going? Feel free to sit down. Thanks, man. I don't know you, right? No. That's what I thought. So, how's it going? Well, I came up here to smoke alone. Oh, that's all right, man. I don't smoke. You know, it's bad for you. My grandpa, he actually, he went up there early because he was a big smoker. I miss him sometimes. You know, now that I think about it, he's actually probably down there. I loved him, but he really wasn't the greatest guy. Funny story, actually. He got caught defrauding the children's cancer clinic that he worked at. Yeah, maybe it was the karma that got him in the end. You know, I got another funny story for you, actually. Earlier today... My I... girlfriend broke up with me earlier. Oh, really? What'd you do? What? I didn't do anything. You know, my grandpa, the one that was uh, defrauding children's hospitals. Yeah? Yeah, well, he wasn't always a bad guy. When I was younger, he used to take me with him to, uh, to the hospital and give me candy to hand out to the patients. My grandma, she left him after 30 years of being married, and I guess he just kind of lost faith after that. You don't have to worry about me, man. I don't feel like defrauding any children's hospitals. Well, what do you feel like? I don't know. Me and her, we would come up here and look down at the world, but now I just am up here alone, and she's down there somewhere. Well, you're not alone, per se. You know, my grandpa, he actually taught me one more lesson. Besides not smoking and not defrauding children's hospitals? Yeah, that's right. You see, when he died, a lot of people came to pay their respects. A surprising amount, actually, considering what he'd done. There were a lot of people that cared about him. He just got busy and lost touch. He was never really alone, he just didn't realize it. I guess I see your point, but she was all I had. You got me. No, I just met you. I love you though. Mm -mm. I literally just met you. Yeah. I still love you though.